Are you there? How are you? Hi, teacher. Hello. Hello. How was your weekend, guys? It was very busy. Yeah. What do you do? Well, I went just to visit my family and we went to the doctor with my oh. boyfriend and a oh. lot of things. <laughs> very busy. And where does where where does your family live? They live in Ciudad Arce. Oh, Sarana. Close to Saran. Close to Santana, yeah. All right. Good. I don't visit family. Why teacher? I don't I don't well I have family, but I don't visit them. You have to. No. <laughs> what? No. My um my aunts already died. They they were close to me, but they died, so I don't visit anymore. Well, my... I just visit my mom. Oh, I good. Just visit yeah. My mom and my and my little sister. All right. I I I used to visit my mom on weekends because she okay. lived she lived she used to live near near my house. But ah. la last year she passed away. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Well, yeah, one year. One year. She has one year. Was on the 20, 20, July the 20th. She, um, she had a year. Oh, that's why I don't, that's what she was the only one that I visited. visited. Yeah, me too. Yeah, I only visit my mom. I don't visit because. Her. Mm -hmm. I used to live with her until March because mm -hmm. of the traffic. I I mm -hmm. work here in San Salvador and it's very difficult to go to my house. I know. Passing passing uh, passing through Los Chorros is a Yeah. It's a nightmare. Yeah, I know. I I understand. Well, I don't remember if we did this exercise, the folly intonation. Yeah, we did. I believe so. Did we practice this pronunciation intonation in statements? Mm -hmm. Do you remember? No. No? no, we didn't. We didn't. We didn't. Okay, good. I guess. What about this conversation? I think we didn't do it neither, right? Well, I guess we talk about family, yeah? Oh, yeah. And yeah. I asked you to... And I ask you to make me question. Remember that I have two daughters, and I have a chucho and a perico. Well, yes, only teacher. only a chucho, not perico. Mm. I have no perico. I used to have a perico, but she died. I mean, I know I don't know where she is. His name She's was Kate. his name was. Uh, oh, I'm sorry about that, Andrea. But my mom, uh, she has a year, year and something. I miss her. I miss my mom. She was my uh, my confident and the only the only one in the world that I could talk about my my feelings, my my privacy, my. Uh, the real me. 
then there's no one. I haven't found someone that she saw. When she died, I lost everything. Well, I don't want to cry here. <laughs> well, let's continue. Sorry, you know? Yeah. Let's continue. Let's talk about family. Let's continue with the family. And asking about families. We have a conversation, a crazy conversation over here. Let me take a picture and then we're gonna practice, okay? I know you wanna practice your English. Yes, teacher, we wanna practice English because we wanna have a good English and talk to Ringos and everyone in, in, in the world who can listen to us because Salvadorian people speak English very nice. Salvadorian people learns English and speak very nice because we got good accent. Believe it or not, we get good accent. Okay. Um, tell me about your brother and sister, Sue. Well, my sister works for the government. Oh, what does she do? I'm not sure. She's working on a very secret project right now. Wow. And what about your brother? He's a wildlife photographer. What an interesting family. Can I meet them? Oh, no. My sister's away. She's not working in the United States this month. And your brother? He's traveling in the Amazon. Got it? Okay. Calling Hello. about. Hello. Any questions? Sorry. No questions. No questions. Okay. Then let's practice. Oh, okay. Go. What is wildlife? Wildlife. Vida salvaje. In the, in the jungle. In the jungle. Okay, Elba, can you help me with the conversation, please? You, you okay. start. Okay, you start. Okay. Okay. So, tell me about your brother and sister, Sue. Well, my sister works for the government. And uh, what... Uh, uh, what does she do? I'm not sure. She's working on a very secret project right now. Whoa. And what about your brother? He's a wildlife photographer. What an interesting family. Can I meet them? Oh, no. My sister's away. She's not working in the United States this month. And your brother? He's traveling in the Amazon. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome, teacher. All right, all right. We got Brenda and Daisy. Brenda and Daisy. Tell me about the brother and sister. Well, my sister works for the government. Oh, what does she do? I'm not sure. She's working on a very secret project right now. Go oh, and what about your brother? He's a wildlife photographer. What an interesting family. Can I meet them? Oh no, my sister away. She's not working in the United States this month. Oh, agarra la clase. Se puede alargar. Ya pagame la noche. He's traveling in the Amazon. Para que lo usas. Allá tienes la computadora donde puedes conectarla. Oh, <laughs> Take, it. Take it easy. Hey, hey, we're listening. We're listening. Be careful. Sobre niños. 
Okay, thank you. Okay, let's go to the rooms before we listen to other <laughs> chapter. Okay. Let's go. And practice, please. Do uh, avoid to use Spanish, okay? Do not use Spanish.
Okay, let's continue. Let's talk about intonation in statements. We know two kinds of uh, intonation, right? We, we know the rising intonation and falling intonation. Rising intonation is when your voice goes up. up. And falling intonation when your voice goes down. Yeah, so you your voice goes like soft, soft. Here in this statement, we are, we have, sorry, we have falling intonation. Okay, you see the arrow, the, the arrow goes, so I'm working in Singapore. She's waiting on the bus stop. They're leaving. They're living at home. Yeah, you see? The voice goes down. Voice goes down. And, bueno, profe, y eso es la entonación para que más servir. It's going to help to sound your English better, beautiful, understandable. Yeah? Because if you have rhythm and intonation, you're going to have a good English, okay? No vamos a, 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 a leer o a decir una pregunta como que fuera una oración simple. Tiene que darle la entonación de una pregunta. Got it? So this is what happened here, okay? I'm working in Singapore. Got it? I'm working in Singapore. She's waiting at the bus stop. You're living at home. Your voice goes down, pero no hay que exagerar. Do not exaggerate, okay? No, no, no vaya a hacer así. I'm working in Singapore. No. She's waiting at the bus stop. No. Mm -mm. They're living at home. No, okay. Natural, natural, okay, natural. I'm working in Singapore. She's waiting at the bus stop. They're living at home. Got it? I'm working in Singapore. She's waiting at the bus stop. They're living at home. Got me? Yeah. Yep. Okay. I need someone. Diana Yamile. Say the three sentences, please. Diana. Diana, hello. Okay, Maho, thank you. Okay, I am working in Singapore. Mm -hmm. She's waiting at the bus stop. They are living at home. Thank you, very nice, okay, bus stop. Another thing. Cuando yo tenga dos palabras, una que finalice en S y la otra comienza en S, hago una S larga. I'm explaining this in Spanish because I need you to get it right, okay? Like, she's waiting at the bus stop. Bus stop. Bus stop. Yes. Got it? Okay. I got Daisy, Estefania, she wants to practice. Okay, teacher. Um, I'm working in Singapore. She's waiting at the bus stop. They are living at home. All right, thank you. She's waiting at the bus stop. Okay, Lucia. Okay, I am working in Singapore. 
She's waiting at the bus stop. She's waiting. They are leaving. She's waiting. Waiting. She's waiting. Waiting. She's waiting on the bus stop. They they are living at home. They're living at home. They're living at home. They're, they're, living. Li they're, they're living. living. They're living at home. They're living at home. They're living at home. They're living at home. You have to practice pronunciation. You have to repeat like a perico. Okay. You repeat, you repeat, you repeat, you repeat, you repeat, and repeat. Okay. That's the only way you have to you can improve your pronunciation. No hay otra manera. No hay otra manera. Okay. Margarita, okay. please help us. I'm working in Singapore. She's waiting at the bus stop. They're living at home. Very good. Perfect. Thank you. Elba, Thank your you. turn. I'm working in Singapore. She's waiting at the bus stop. They're living at home. Excellent. Very good. Very nice. Dina Esmeralda. Yeah. I work in, in Singapore. Mm -hmm. She's going in the in the bookstore. Um they living at home. Okay, home. thank you, Dina. Yeah, they're living at home. Thank you. Fatima Larisa. Yes, teacher. I'm working I I'm working in Singapore. Mm -hmm. Waiting at the bus stop. They're living at home. Yeah, okay, good. The last one. Estela. I working in Singapore. She's waiting at the bus stop. They're living at home. All right, very good. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for loving me, opening my eyes. I couldn't see. Da -da -da. Thank you for loving me. Cantada es mejor. Okay, we're going to talk about present continuous. What is present continuous for? Present continuous is used to talk about things that are happening right at the moment. That is one of the main uh, uses that present continuous has. Tiene otros usos, sí. But right now, only things that are happening at the moment. Okay, actions that are happening at the moment. What are happening right now? What am I doing right now? Right now, I'm teaching. I'm teaching English, I'm teaching, I'm giving a lesson, I'm speaking, and you are listening, you are paying attention, you are participating in class, yeah, writing. You, you are writing on the chat, you are uh, practicing pronunciation, so those are the things that are happening right now, okay, that is present continuous for right here right now as hay una canción que right here right now da, 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 da. yeah 80s music all right tengo problemas ah problema no dele dele duro a la señal ¿Eh? knock it down knock it down okay let's continue and let's talk about present continuous okay we we have to Two grammar patterns, okay? Let's study the grammar patterns. It's been so cold. Look at my face. All the stories he will tell like any race. The path was long. 
You are a good singer, teacher. Oh, <laughs> never. I got a, a awful voice. No, I like to sing. I don't care. I just sing. When I'm gone. I want to cut it down because I need space. I need room because I want to explain some things. Okay, let's talk about the first. Let's talk about the first. My my daughters are watching a Paquita in a series. I I I I can't stand that kind of series. I don't like. It. But what can I do? Nothing. Okay, let's see. Um, let's let's write the pattern. I know the pattern is easy for you, but let's explain it. Okay. So we have B subject. Ver ing plus complement. Got it? This is what I want you to understand or just review. We are we're just reviewing because this is very teacher for you. Yeah. This is easy for you. Yeah, got it? If you if you memorize, if you memorize the pattern. That's it. You are going to create good questions, good sentences, good communication. So this is this is what we have here. Ya vieron que tenemos dos tipos de pregunta, verdad? So the first are the yes no questions. Okay, yeah, teacher, I know what a yes no question. What is a yes no question? Where well, you say yes and you say no. By the moment. Ahorita sí va a decir, ya. Yeah. Oh, we have the B, it gets B. The verb B is or are, okay? So I'm going to say, is your girlfriend? Oh, your girlfriend is the subject. Got it? Your girlfriend, your girlfriend. Not my girlfriend. I don't have a girlfriend. I'm single. Okay. And is your girlfriend. Oh, sorry. I, no, no. Is your girlfriend playing? What? Playing what? What a sport? Help me. Help me. Playing soccer. Playing soccer. Thank you. You're very kind. Look, take a look at the structure. Is your girlfriend playing soccer? Yes, she is. No, she's not. Por el momento, si va a responder. Moreover, you're going to add more information, okay? No necesariamente tiene que quedarse con un sí o un no. You can add more information. But right now, that's okay. No more, okay? That's it. Now, a teacher, let's let's um, let's write an example with R. Okay, R. My students and my students is the subject. You are the subject. Look, are my students paying attention? Yes, we are. We are good students and we are paying attention. Yes or no? Yes. Yeah. Sí, querido profesor, se dice. 
Yes, yeah, your teacher. Yeah. Hey, hey. Ya tiene 10. El primer lugar se va a llevar. Okay. <laughs> okay, thank you. Now, understand the pattern? Yep. If you understand the pattern, write me a question on the chat. Vamos. Mándeme una. Only one question. One question. No sentence. Question. No sea una pregunta. Pues, say me a, say me a question, please. Say me a question. Yes, yes. Yes, I am, Pablo. Very good. No, I'm not eating cake. Sadly, I'm not. I would like to eat a piece of chocolate cake, but there's nothing. Okay, continue. I like those sentences. Beautiful, beautiful, sorry, beautiful questions. The two questions are nice. Are you, of course, I enjoy teach only when I'm I'm really tired. It's hard for me, but today I'm I'm okay. I'm I'm good. Uh, uh I enjoy in this class. Yes, Elba. I think that's a very pretty good um question. Continue, please continue. Hurry up. Hurry up. Is your sister studying? No, she no, she's not. Are you swimming? No, I'm not swimming in the pool. Are you studying English? Yes, yeah, sometimes I study. Are you? No, I'm not listening to music. When I listen, I listen to metal music. Are you hungry? Yes, I am hungry. I already had dinner, but I'm still hungry. I could eat three pupusas. Yeah. Are you? Yes, I'm living. No, I'm living in the moon. I'm not living in El Salvador. I'm living in the moon. <laughs> okay, okay. Hey, good, good questions. Are you? Yes, I'm. <laughs> yes, I am. Yes, I am. I'm living in the moon. I'm living in Mars. I'm living in Neptune. I'm living in uh, Saturn. Are you learning English a lot? Oh, are you? Are you learning a lot of English? Yes, every day we learn new new words. <clears throat> Let me see. I have a raised hand over there. Who's who is it? My oh no, that was my Maho. She already practiced. Are you no? I'm not listening to. Are you reading now? No. Oh yes, I'm reading. I'm reading your questions. Good for me. Are you sure? Yes, I, I'm trying to. Let's continue and let's talk about the other part. I'm going to erase this. I'm going to send a picture. And then. Okay. Because I need to explain another thing. Okay, let's talk about the other pattern. What is the other pattern? The other pattern is uh, information question with present continuous. So we have the WH word plus B plus da, 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 subject plus verb ing plus complement. In this case, it's a time expression. Yeah, we have time expressions here.
That is a time expression, okay? What are the time expressions? Now, these days, this week, this morning, this afternoon, today, tonight. Got it? Tonight, we are young. You know what is good to learn English? Listen to music. Listen to music. But listen to music in English, not, not agropecuaria. Okay. All right, listen. To learn English, you have to listen to music in English, not in Espanol. Okay, eso déjelo para después, okay? Now I'm going to give you an example over here, the WH word. We have the WH word, yes. We have where, we have what, we have who, we have when, how, what time, etc. Okay, so let me see. You see that you see that that uh, question. What are you doing right now? What are you doing right now? I'm studying English. Teacher. Hello. I have a question. Yes. Eh, está compartiendo. Es que creo que se congeló la pantalla porque yo solo veo este, la presentación, pero las preguntas sobre el presente continuo no sé si está escribiendo. A mí tampoco me salían, teacher. Creo que se le había frisado la pantalla. Ay, sí, ya. Yo ya veo lo que está escribiendo. Pues sí, teacher, yo también. Sorry. Not problem. Yes, it's problem because I explained it. But this is the second part. So what are you doing right now? We are paying attention to the class. All right, thank you. You're paying attention. Someone are, some of you are writing. Yeah, some of you are writing. Some of you are taking notes. That is the same thing. Yeah. Some of you are drinking water. Some of you are chatting. Yeah. So that is the pattern. And the pattern here is. You see another question. What is your teacher doing? Yes. Teaching. I'm teaching, right? I'm teaching. And I'm explaining. Yeah. I'm confusing my student. No. <laughs> okay, so this is the grammar pattern with WH word, what? Or can be who, can be where, can be when. Yeah. And then the verb be subject, verb ing, and a time expression or complement. Got it? Now, write me a question, please. Write a question on the chat.
where are your daughters? Uh, they're watching TV. They're watching Paquita. Yeah. Mm, I'm not planning anything. I'm just planning to work more and more and more. Well, good question. This midnight I'm going to to use a spell. Yeah, midnight. Gonna use a spell on someone. At me. Now I'm gonna be snorking, snorking, and I don't know, dreaming something. I go. What time? Ah, but that it does not present continuous. What time do you go to sleep? Is not present continuous. Uh, also that that's not a good one because you say what are you doing last week and last week is 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 past maybe this week yes what are you doing this week working ah that's much better what time are you going to sleep yes that's a good one. Okay, around 10. I go to sleep around 10. I'm not watching TV. I feel tired, so I don't watch TV. I just upload the videos and then fall asleep. I'm feeling, I'm feeling happy. I'm feeling happy because my students are learning. Okay, we're finished. Um, I I already had dinner, but for tomorrow we like to have uh, beans, uh, egg with ham and vegetables, a piece of cheese, three tortillas, toasted tortillas, and. Uh, water or chocolate i'm not practicing any sport i'm just i'm just uh, walking maybe this coming month i'm gonna start going to the gym again and that's it okay friends let's go and let's work on the presentation we have a we have something over there Okay, thanks for your participation. And I see you understand present continuous. Let's work on this. These are some uh, fun conversation using present continuous. Please uh, use the verb in parentheses and don't forget to use the verb be. 
besides the subject. Okay? Start working, please. Um, I'm not, go oh, well, I'm going to work, Lucia, this weekend. But at night, I go out with friends sometimes. Sometimes, and when I have money. <laughs> Okay, let's work, please, on these exercises.
All right, my friends, let's work on the first conversation. So, hi, Stephanie, what? How are you doing? How are you doing? Thank you. What are you doing? Hey, Mark. Uh, uh huh. Standing in an elevator. Okay. An okay. Yes, that's okay. But what happened with the verb be? I am. I am. Ah, uh, am. Uh, you can do I'm it in standing. a contract. I'm standing. I'm standing. I'm still standing. I'm standing. Espérame que la arreglo. Sorry, Sam. Oh, yes. Sorry. Well, that's why we have erasers. Wow. Yeah. I'll kick it. Okay. I'm standing in an elevator and it's stuck. Oh no, are you okay? Yeah. I wait it. It's moving. It's, it's moving. It's now. moving now. Great. It's moving now. Let's go to the next one. Marcy. How are you and Justin enjoying your shopping trip? How are you and Justin? I am enjoying their shopping trip. Yeah, your shopping trip. We, uh, we are uh, having, having a lot of fun. We are having a lot of fun. Uh huh. Is your brother? Is your brother spending? Spending. Spending a lot of money. No, mom. He's buying. Buying they want or two things. That's all. He's buying only one or two things. That's all. Okay, good. And that's it. Says, hi, Stephanie, what are you doing? Hey, Mark, I'm standing in an elevator and it's stuck. Oh, no. Are you okay? Yeah. Uh, wait, wait. It's moving now. Thank goodness. Number two, Marcy, how are you? And Justin, how are you and Justin enjoying your shopping trip? We are having a lot of fun. Is your brother spending a lot of money? No, mom. He's buying only one or two things. That's all. Uh -huh. <laughs> all right, my friends. Uh, we're going to stop here. Because it's time to call the attendance. Sorry about that. I guess it's time. I hope you enjoyed the class. I was... Having fun too. Let me see.
Ok, let me call Andrea de Los Ángeles Musum. Present teacher. Thank you. Brenda Carolina Mejía. Present teacher. Thank you. Daniela Beatriz Cerritos. Present. Thank you. David Moisés Ventura. Present. Thank you. Daisy Estefanía Carrillo. Present. Thank you. Diana Yamilet Alas. Present. Thank you. Dina Esmeralda Ortiz. Present. Thank you. Eved Jaciel Cardoza. Thank you. Elba Isabel Zúñiga de Orellana. Present teacher. Emily Nicole Ramírez Mendoza. Eric Ronaldo Rosales. Present teacher. Thank you. Erika Marilú Estrada. Present teacher. Thank you. Estela Guadalupe Maravilla. Present teacher. Thank you. Fátima Larisa Melara. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Freddy Ernesto Gutierrez. Present. Thank you. Jennifer Sarayi Vigil. Present. Thank you. Julia Margarita Rivas. Present teacher. Thank you. Lucía del Carmen Mejía. Present teacher. Thank you. María José Cucufate. Present teacher. Thank you. Marvin Alexander Ramírez. Pablo Alejandro Vázquez. I'm here, teacher. Thank you. Roberto Carlos Perdomo. Present. Thank you. Rosibel Esmeralda Laínez. Present, teacher. Thank you. Sandy Roxana Díaz. Present. Ah, yo creo que estas personas ya no atienden, pero dice Selena del Carmen Pérez. Okay. En Vanessa Elizabeth Medina. No iba a aquí. Okay. Wendy Adamaris Pleites. Present teacher. Thank you. Selena Yamilet Reyes. Present. Thank you. En Zulma Natividad Alvarado. Present. Thank you. Okay, that's all for now. See you tomorrow. Take care. Bye, teacher. Bye. Bye teacher. Have a nice red. Bye. Good night. Bye. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye, teacher. Good night. Bye. Bye, teacher. Bye.